Hey everyone, I just wanted to make a uh, video of my weekend up at the cabin at the Little Beaver, and here I am all packed, so we're ready to go. Dane and I are going up, so I hope you guys enjoy. I'll see you on the road. That was like the best, the best race last yeah, year. That was a good year, year, man. That was a good year. <laughs> We're all there. I bet Jeremy could have came. Yeah. We'll get a good year where there's more people in the bunks that we have. We we'll set up tents. We get all of us, Jeremy, Justin, their girls, and kid. Yeah. Ethan, and Quinn, their girls. Blake and our kids. Like two dozen people. Yeah. That'd be awesome. I'd sleep in the tent. I don't care. I'd love to do that. That'd be a blast. Yeah. It's uh, going on 9 o'clock. We just arrived here at the Little Beaver. Gonna go in here and check it out. Get fired up. Yep. Have a good time. We're there, man. It rained on and off most of the day on Saturday. It was just above freezing outside. What do you expect from the end of November? Other than it being cold and wet outside, it was a great weekend. There's something very calming about the quiet here. There are no cars, trains, or airplanes passing by. This is a great place to relax. All right, for this next section, I'm gonna take you guys inside the little beaver so you can get a feel of what it's like to spend time here.
These are the men that built the cabin. The Little Beaver was constructed in 1951. This cabin has provided families with countless memories for five generations. It will continue to do the same for generations to come. All right, now for this next section, I'm going to take you guys inside the little beaver so you can get a feel of what... <laughs> <laughs> okay.